What's up, guys? Back with part three of the Legend of the Crystal Skull. And, uh, yeah, let's get right into it. No music for the intros, as you. Here's my center of operation. Load. I still haven't found a name for the what the save file is gonna be, so yeah, we still gotta do that. But now, I think we can. I don't think we can talk to anybody here. So. so Explore the cemetery for a minute. To figure out if there's anything camouflaged in that design, I'm gonna need some paper. Yes. Hmm. How are we gonna find paper? Can't go in there. Um, you can ask her. Oops. Hello again. Do you by any chance have some plain paper that I could use? I most certainly do, but it's up in my room. And I'm afraid I cannot retrieve it for you until I'm finished here. Uh, you get the sudden urge to draw a picture? Something like that. I know, I'll help you. That way you'll get done faster. Gracious, you are the picture of impatience, aren't you? Yes. Well, I appreciate the offer. But here, why don't you just take this instead? It's an extra key to my room. The paper's in a drawer in my nightstand. I have to keep it hidden on account of that paper thieving iguana. Just go on up and help yourself. But make sure you lock the door when you leave, you hear? You I trust. But Henry, him I do not. Wow. I really appreciate this. And long as you're going up there, my appetite could use a little placating. So I would be much obliged if you would bring me a candy bar from my nightstand. And take one for yourself while you're at it. Okay. Let's do that. Upstairs. That probably that locked door. Okay. Um, here. One for Renee. And one for me. Bless mm. it. Yeah. Oh. Okay. It's in here. Oh, I just took something. A piece of paper. What the heck? Creepy doll. Box. Let's do this. Okay. So, so, so. Um, I have it around here. Okay. So it's this one. This one. This one. And this one. There we go. Okay, the next one is. This one. This one. Bottom. This one. Messed it up. Next one. Okay, so it's right under it. And the one two below. And the one in the middle. And then one. There we go. Next, this one is right above that one, two above actually. So this one, then, wait, what am I looking at? Yeah, this one, 
then these two, then this one. There we go. Last one. This one. This two. This one. Ah, messed that one up. Okay. Um, this one definitely. One, two. And that's wrong. No, that is right. That's right. No, one, two, three. And the third two. Okay, and then you go here. There we go. Stop. Hoodoo signs and sim symbols. Weird. Weird stuff, lady. What do you have this weird book in your stuff for? that bag. That's it. Hmm. Hiccup powder. Are you good? All she has on her desk. that paper to her. You bring me that Coco Kringle ball like I asked? Right here. Bless you. I'm so hungry I could devour these plants I'm potting up, dirt and all. How else may I be of service to you? Those weird symbols on the wall in your room, do you know who painted them? I did. Fact of the matter is, there's a spirit living in that wall. Really? A spirit? Got a voice that it sends shivers down the spine of Dracula himself. Used to hear it sometimes, in the dead of night, half talking, half whispering, saying this one word I never heard before, like it was from a language no one on earth spoke. And suddenly, I knew. The spirit was trying to cast a spell on me, so I got me a book and found out that by painting the word I heard on the wall, syllable by syllable, in hoodoo signs, I could counteract the word's power. And you really? know what? The spirit has not spoken that word or any other since. What was the word? Darling, a sack full of water moccasins couldn't get me to say that word out loud. Mm. Nor will I write it down, no sir. Not ever, ever, ever. I'll leave you to your potting. Fare the well. I don't think the spider likes us, but I think I have something for him. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If that spider is poisonous, I could be in trouble. Because I'm starting to feel kind of... Uh-oh. Uh, I must have messed that up. Okay, so it's, uh... One... Two... Three... Five, six, 
seven, eight. Stupid spider. Let's go sketch that one marking off. Rotten spider, just like that rotten bird. Okay. A bird. Our way. I ain't messing up right here, guys. Okay. Let's call people. Ned, Ned, Ned. We need to call Ned. Hi, Nancy. Hey, Ned. What's going on? I could use a hint. About what? Where can I get the key to that big crypt in the cemetery? The one with the interesting carvings on it. Know the scale model of the cemetery Bruno Bole kept in his great room? Yeah. Well, if you take a real good look at it, you'll see the crypt you're talking about. Figure out how to open it, and you'll be able to open its life-sized counterpart. That tracing you found should help you. Sounds good. Thanks. No big deal. See ya. Alright. Yes? I'll check back with you later. Whatever. Sure. Already did the books. Anything we can do over here? No. Check back in your room if you miss anything, maybe? Tried it. Didn't work. What is this fake wall? How do we get in there? Let's call him. Let's call Ned for another hit. Hi, Nancy. Hey, Ned. What's going on? How about a hint? What do you need? Where can I get the key to that Same big question, crypt in the cemetery? The one with the interesting carvings on it. Know the scale model of the cemetery Bruno Bole kept in this great room? Yeah. Well, if you take a real good look at it, you'll see the crypt you're talking about. Figure out how to open it, and you'll be able to open its life-sized counterpart. That tracing you found should help you. Great. I really appreciate it. You need anything else? Just call. Oh. I should go look at the crypt. Um. Nope. So it's like over here. Where is the crypt again? It right there. Oops, wrong way. Oops. 
we need that key or something, right? Like, surely we need that key. It's not the spiders. Let's try it again. Or otherwise, let's actually, let's get that, let's play that one game in the great room. Let's play that one game. Okay. Wrong way. Over here. Right here. Over here. I have like instructions and stuff like that. Alright, so one. Gotta get the ball. So get the ball there. That's not mine. Ah, all I need to do is get that ball one above it. Get the ball here. I can move it there to block it. Why did I do that? It's stuck. Oh no. I shouldn't have did that. That was stupid. I shouldn't have did that. I can totally do this, guys. I can totally do this.
got stuck. How do I get this to block there? Do I only have to get the ball there? What if I do, I'm gonna try something else. What if I try this? I'll try to only get the ball there. I have to do what I just did. I have to block that off. There. Why is this the hardest thing ever? Alright, so I'll figure that off off camera eventually. So, yeah. I think we'll call Bess and see if she can do anything. Hello? Hey, what's going on? That's funny. That's what I was going to ask you. I'll see you later. Bye. Gilbert Buford. Another question? Thanks for your time. Feel free to drop by any time. Eat, maybe?
Sneeze lady, what's going on? Whoa. That gumbo stand outside? What do you think? Is it pretty authentic? Outstanding! Just watch the hot sauce. Whatever's in it gives my stomach instant fits. In all your journeys through the wonderful world of junk, have you ever come across one of those legendary crystal skulls? What makes you ask that? You have so many other oddities in here, I was just wondering. No. I know the legend, of course, and I sure wouldn't mind getting my hands on one of those babies. I mean, I could sell it for a fortune, but no such luck. Funny. I've been thinking about those skulls lately. A lot. Really? Hey, maybe we got some kind of psychic thing going here. Quick, nah. think of a number between 1 and 10 and I'll try to guess it. You thinking of a number? Okay, uh, 4. 9. Darn. Guess it was just a coincidence. Guess so. There's a man sitting at the gumbo stand outside named Gilbert Buford. Do you know him? We're not close personal friends or anything, but I certainly know of him. Comes from one of the wealthiest and most prominent families in New Orleans. And on top of all that, he's a doctor. Guy's gotta be rolling in dough. Must be nice, huh? Maybe I'll have another look around in here. You got a question, just holler. All right, guys, we're gonna round it off here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for part four, I'm episode four. My bad.